The world of BMX racing has come to Louisville for the NBL War of the Stars UCI BMX World Championship. We are getting set for the Elite Women final event. And in gate number one, a very fine racer by the name of Corinne Chabonneau. Next to her, Natasha Williams from Australia. Elodie Aigienka from France. Michelle Carnes giving us a smile and a wink. Marie McGilvery next to her. Ellen Mullensi from Belgium sets up next to Marie McGilvery. Tatiana Schosher. And in lane number eight, Gabriela Diaz from Argentina. She has the game face on. We are underway with the elite women. The first one to the finish line will be crowned world champion and Gabriela Diaz proving that she is worthy of that. Take a look at the lead she has over Marie McGilvery. A huge lead. Marie trying to shorten the gap, but Gabriela Diaz with an outstanding start. Maybe the best start of the day. Over the table, into that big right turn. In third place right now, we have a very fine Agienka from France. But Marie McGilvery in second in front of her, and then Gabriela Diaz leading the pack of eight racers around this track. Gabriela Diaz from Argentina proves that she is number one. Marie McGilvery finishes in second place. Bull and C in sixth. We're here with Gabriela Diaz, the elite women winner. Gabriela has a really good race, really smooth over the jumps. Had a lot of manuals. What possessed you to pull up for some of those jumps? She got a really hard man because uh, she got a lane eight and she got a good K and she went to the inside lane and put, pick up the, the first jump manual and she got really good so that's, that's made a difference, the man. Gabriel, you've been over in the United States racing all summer. How did you approach this race any differently? Que estuviste corriendo todo el verano acá. ¿Cómo fueron todas? ¿Cómo fue el circuito que hiciste? Eh, bueno, me fue muy bien. Eh, corrí... Eh, she, bueno, she won a lot of races in summer. And she won a lot of state championship and local races. And she feel really good. I mean, like, she's happy in Florida because she lives in Miami. And she expect a lot for next year. And she can win the, the NBL title, too. So. Well, congratulations and good luck and thank you. Thanks. It's the race to the first turn. The whole shot has been key today. Warwick Stevenson in first place. Randy Stumphauser in second. Ivo Lukuch in third and Berkheimer also battling for the top four. The top four will advance. Warwick Stevenson in the green and the yellow jersey. Right behind him, Stumphauser in second place. What a great battle this is. Warwick Stevenson took the lead into the first turn, and he is not going to give it up. Stevenson will advance. So, too, will Stumphauser, Ivo Lukuch, and Nathan Berkheimer. Those four will make up half of the Elite Men Final as we get set for the Elite Men Semi-Final. The other four will come from this round. And we are underway, not wasting any time here in Louisville, Kentucky. Oh, a major blowout over the first roller. Coming out of there unscathed, the X Games gold medalist in downhill BMX, Brandon Meadows, Jason Richardson in second place, Dale Holmes in third, Luke Medill right now in fourth. But how about Brandon Meadows getting out in front of Trouble's Way? Jason Richardson, the fine racer in second place, Dale Holmes in third. So it will be those three plus Luke Medill advancing to the next round. Well, one of my favorite riders on the circuit is Danny Nelson. And Danny, this event certainly has a different flavor to it, doesn't it? Yeah, you know, the world. You get people from 30 some odd different countries, everybody involved. Hype's real high, so people stun people over their heads, but it's exciting. Your thoughts about this track? Obviously, you know, there's a little talk about the track, and that's always something that we talk about, but how do you like it? You know, it's going to work out. There's going to be a champion at the end of the day. It might be a little soft. The section's a little tough over here, but uh, separates the men from the boys, you know, so we'll see.